guys, it's Kylie, and today's video is 10 things twins can relate to. So, as most of you probably don't know, I am actually a twin. Um, we are not identical twins, but it's me and my sister. Um, so in this video, I'm going to share with you 10 things that most twins can relate to. Um, that are like just typical like twin things. Some of these are more based because we're the same gender, so like... Um, you're not gonna do some of them if you have a bro if it's a brother and sister, but um, other ones are just twins in general can relate to. Um, so the first thing is when you're getting gifts and stuff, people just assume you're gonna share. So they get you one thing and your sister another thing, even though like they're totally different things and they know you want them both. Um, they just assume, oh, you can trade and share and stuff. Not always does that work. Not always do you want to share with your twin. Um, you might want to keep something for yourself. Um, the next thing is. Um, when you're younger, um, if like one twin gets invited to a birthday party, a lot of times they'll just invite you to the birthday party anyways, even if you're not friends with them. So you kind of get like the pity invite or later they'll be like, oh, I don't really like, they feel like they should invite you, but they don't want to invite you. So like they won't, but they know they should. So like you almost give them like a little guilt when they're inviting you to things. Um, the third thing is you always have um, someone to like take homework from. So when you're like, doing you just don't feel like doing a class's homework if assuming you're in the same similar classes um you can always just kind of steal their homework and copy off of theirs like they're always there to study with or do like school work with which is nice to have um a fourth one is um you always have like a built-in friend so they're always there if you actually need somebody to talk to or if you like are having a hard time when in elementary school if you're having a hard time making friends um they're there for you and you can always just hang out with their their friends usually they'll let you tag along um also with a twin um you learn to answer to multiple names so i mean if you're in a big family you usually have to do this anyways you'll answer to any of your siblings names but if people are like say like your sister's sibling's name or your twin's name you're usually learn to answer it to it anyways and you're like whatever just let it go um that might bother you when you're little but i've gotten over and i'll answer to kylie or samantha i don't care um because not everybody even though we're not identical not everybody always calls us by the right name um the next one is everybody always asks stupid questions so they ask who's older oh my god you're twins are you twins who's like and it's like always answer i'm gonna take pride in it i'm older by nine minutes but you always get the question on who's older um the next one is you always a lot of times if you don't get two different gifts to share you get the same gift just in two different colors so like i'll get a pink one and he'll, she'll get a blue one or i'll get a purple and sweatshirt and she'll get a blue sweatshirt and they just assume oh if you don't like the color you'll just switch um the following thing um, is people, some people believe that you have, like, telepathic abilities, so if I get hurt, that she's gonna feel that she got hurt, and stuff like that, which is not true, if you believe that's true, um, I don't know why people just assume that's true, um, and then some people just assume, because you're twins, you do everything together, so that you have the exact same interests and the same that, which is not always true, we're actually very different people, um, we like very different things, um, but many people just assume that I have the exact same interests as her, or she has the exact same interests as me. So if I do one thing, or like, that you're all at the same skill level as some, each other. And then the last thing is, people, like you always have, some, this is more like for both gender, if you have the same gender, you always have somebody to share your clothes with, so like, if I get a shirt, and I stop wearing it, and she, or she wants to wear it, well you can just always trade, like, I have plenty of t-shirts that are mine that she wears or I wear her clothes so it gives you something if you like oh I want a different outfit today you can go through like they'll let you look you can go through their stuff give you um some of the clothes um so that's 10 things that um uh, all twins usually can relate to most of those are things that um happen to all different twins um but there I will say um it's nice to have a twin even though you may not think, oh, or like if you're an only child, you're like, yeah, I wish I had a twin. There's always the ups and downs, no matter what sibling you have. Um, there's perks to having a twin and everything's like some things you can do all together because you're the same age. And then there's other things that you're like, I wish I could just do it alone and then have a twin, like sharing your birthday or different things like that. So there's always the ups and downs, but that's with all siblings. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're a twin, I hope you could relate to some of this. Um, don't forget to comment down below, if, especially if you could relate to some of this and if you're a twin. Um, also, check out some of my other videos. I'm doing beta, so I'm posting a video every day of April. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Bye!